Next up is this paper. It's been on my desk for a while. It's a letter from Google. Okay, that's it. I'm done with it. All this stuff. Like the way this desk looks right now with all the stuff on it. This needs to change now because I can feel I've been editing a lot and like all this stuff. It's not supposed to be there. It's distracting me and it's keeping me away from focusing on my work. Let's start with this chair. I mean, there's a laptop bag on this chair. There's not supposed to be a laptop bag on a chair. So first of all, I see my charger is also still on this table yeah, next yeah. to it. I don't even need a charger at my uh, desk as I use a external dock which also charges my laptop so I, I don't even know why it's here so let's just it's not time for me to go <laughs> good like I died like a marker here Johnny boy an old contract for renting gear the script of the shoot I'm editing now these we need for the edit like that that's really important next we have some SD cards here let's put this in our camera bag it shouldn't be at the desk it should be ready for when you're shooting next up is this paper it's been on my desk for a while it's a letter from Google I think I know what it is I signed up my company Dairy Slow on uh, Google Business or something like this just so it's easier for potential clients to find my company and I think it's just like a confirmation thingy how does this work it'll just ask me to confirm my business or something like this and they're really fancy with these these things that you need to rip off so nobody can open it without you knowing that someone has already opened it before. I'm really not a big fan of this Gorilla Pot. Like the way my camera is always positioned, it, it just feels like it's gonna fall at any point. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys use Gorilla Pots and if not, what else you are using because I'm kind of looking for an alternative but I can't really seem to find one. All right, let's see. It's just something to verify my business. Just so this can get off my desk and this is over with. Hello from Google, the verification code that there is low requested from Google is below. Just follow the steps to verify my business. Uh, Google.com slash verify my business. Enter verification code. Verify. All right, perfect. That's done. I don't know if there's anything useful or like interesting, but we'll find out together, I guess. Add business description. Let customers find out more about your business. Let's change the angle a little bit. It feels like I'm talking to the side. I want to be talking to you guys. It's more personal. Bam, bam. Much better. Add business description. Let the customers find out more about your business. All right. I want to keep it short yet easy to understand. So I went for very slow. A video production company specialized in tailor-made cinematic content from short films to ads and even live events for your company and or organization. Feel free to give me some advice in the comments down below or hit me up with a DM. Could be useful, I'm not that good at it. Anyways, let's save this for now and see if there's any further steps we need to do. Your business profile is almost ready. You can continue making updates and edits to your profile at any time. Good, thank you, Google. Okay, so there's like two puts ads and stuff like that that's kind of cool but this will be something for a different video as i just want to clean this mess up and continue editing but google business ta, 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 ta. this way i won't forget i'm actually a really big fan of this whiteboard it's just a huge magnet attached to my fridge and i put two beneath one another just so i have more surface area to work on I'm a big fan of it. So we have some more scrap paper. Ah, this I still need to scan, so I will keep it over here. Now this desk is a story for a different day. As you can tell, it's a huge mess. However, this will be fixed on another day. Today I just wanna get this one clear as I'm working on it and I need more space. I need to clear my mind. So let's bam, a business card of my, uh, of my brother. A little booklet for ideas. It doesn't need to be out all the time. It can just be in here. Bam. One pen fell down. Put it with the other pens. You have a different idea book for video and photo ideas. Even has my name on it. Kind of like the way this looks. It was just a little black notebook uh, when I bought it. I actually bought it in Crete when I was there in the summer of 2019 and it's been lasting me ever since. Um, but I really like the way it looks. I don't know why, but there's something about the DIY kind of style that I'm a big fan of. 
getting a lot better. We have a water bottle that actually needs to be filled up. And now it can go in the fridge. Uh, I need to do some groceries because, yeah, this whole fridge situation, uh, it's kind of empty. Another pen and a marker. They can both go with the other ones. A little rubber band. I'll place it here and ignore it for now. And then some regular scrap papers I will need because when I'm editing I like to take some actual notes. Then the keyboard can just stay next to this. But then maybe let's clean it up a little bit more like this. Why is there two euros here? We have a headphone jack splitter. Uh, let's just place it here with the other one. Another notebook. Now the thing with this notebook, actually let me check it right now. I believe I've completed this one. By the way, if you are wondering why I have so many notebooks with a TUI sign on there, because actually the other one I put away earlier also has a TUI sign on it, is because I used to work for the travel agency TUI, so I still have some notebooks laying around from them. We shouldn't be keeping full notebooks, so let's let me throw it away. We got some more scrap paper, scrap paper. This is actually a design I was working on for a uniform, but I already have a different idea in mind, so they can go. And then last but not least, we have a different copy of the script. I'll just put it to the side for when it's finished. And this, ladies and gentlemen, looks a lot better. Let's just fix the keyboard in a nicer place. Pam, look at this. Now I have some time again to work well time what am i saying now i have some headspace like this will be a lot easier to work on i find it to be very important to have a clean and tidy workspace now this is coming from a guy whose desk has been like a complete mess over the past couple of days but i felt my productivity going down by not having a clean desk so if your desk is messy clean it you will thank me later so for to yeah that, that i guess that's it